Hey guys, welcome back. Ragnar here. It's nice to have you with me today. Got a bit of something new for you. Obviously, I was using that Mose Bros last time. In it's been about a week now. It's my beard's feeling nice and really soft. Not like ball pubes. It's feeling more soft and less coarse than that. But I do have a new thing for you today. Something I've been doing for a while. It does save a bit of money in the long run. Makes things a little bit easier. It is a bit messy. Can well, it can be a bit messy. Hence why I've got no top on today. Don't get excited, you filthy animals. I make my own. This is grapeseed massage and skincare oil from Holland and Barrett. I don't know if you can see that properly. The bottle's a bit battered. I've had it a while. Um, and then all you got to do is get some of this stuff that they do as well. It's called Mia Roma. This is lavender, soothing, 100% pure essential oil. A couple of drops of this type of stuff. I've got some patchouli as well, so I might do another video in the future and get the patchouli out. But today I'm feeling a bit of lavender. All you do is, it's the same principle as on your beard oil. You just get a couple of drops of the base oil, which is your grapeseed. A couple of drips in the hand. It's about six. We come back with your essential oil. Same again, you just dab it on. Five of those. And then obviously if you don't think that consistency is good enough for you, I mean you can see it there in my hand, it's a fairly decent sized puddle. Um, you can obviously add more base oil. If you don't like the smell, you can add a bit more to it so you can be stronger, weaker. I just like lavender. I love lavender quite a lot, so I'll stand to put a bit more in than that. Same again, get it all over your hands, start with the bottom, really, really good hard smush in there, make sure it gets all the way to the skin, knead it in nice and nice and firm, and then it's guaranteed to get all the way through the beard. Take a second hand again, start from the outside with this one, push it through, and slightly, softly just comb it through your hands so you've got all the oil on all the hairs an extra rub try and get some of that oil moving around the skin back on the face just to bring it all in my beard's quite wispy at the minute I need to get into the barbers and get it trimmed down but at least I got rid of the moustache for you all give that a bit a little bit of a twist like I said in the last video, mine curls up. I find just twisting it just gives it a bit of balance to either splay it to the side or it will make it stick down. There we go. And that's it. And like I say, I'll show you the products again. It was literally just Mi Aroma essential oil. I'll put a link in the description for Holland and Barrett for that stuff as well. Like I said, I do have patchouli, which I might do another video on in the future. If you guys like this one and then the base oil is the grapeseed oil I get a really good base I think it's cost me about eight quid in I've had it for a while and I've just got to halfway like I say depending on how much you use of it depending on how long it lasts that's what I nearly spilt them then I would not have been happy getting oil all over the floor yeah so just make sure everything's all trimmed in as good as it's going to get in it with my ugly mug. Right. Well, thank you for watching, guys. Please throw a video. On it. Please throw a video. Don't throw a video. That's, that's not a good thing to do at all, is it? Please throw a like on the video, is what I meant to say. Please subscribe for more videos. And then, like I say, if there's something you're more interested in, just leave me a comment below. Um, and I'll do some more. So at the minute I've got a patchouli. If there's any other scents I come across that I quite like, I'll buy some more. I might get some pine. Or some beach tar. Beach tar is quite nice. Nice smoky smell. Wicked. Well, thank you for coming along. And I hope to see you again.